Hi traders, S&P 500 lost 0.8% last week, a small pullback which we expected in our last week review and after a four week 5% Trump rally which is now losing power. The market is currently balanced with no real reason to move lower or higher so that the next move will probably be triggered by upcoming news and we have plenty of those this week. The Italian poll for example, the public poll which may lead to a new Brexit, Brexit 2, the Austrian elections which are today and the EU central bank, bank meeting on Thursday. So the conclusion is very simple, both market directions are valid. However, in my opinion, a small advantage to the bears. Let's take a technical view of the markets. As we can see the S&P 500 pulled back from the highs and now is supported by a very strong support area and again I expect the market to visit just below or higher this area but I don't expect big drastic market moves. Let's take a look at last week picks. My first pick last week was DD long which did great over 4%, 4.7% and as usual we take our profits at 3% and we hold the last quarter hopefully it will continue higher but if not if it comes back to the entry point we will be out. So last quarter is left with DD. The same applies for GPS and as you can see the short in GPS worked out fine, moved more than 3% and as usual we take our profits at 3% and hold the last quarter. Hopefully it will continue moving down. Let's take a look at this week's picks. My first pick for the week is FA Long Foot Locker. It looks great, very nice uptrend and it's a very well-known sport retailer. Now we are at the holiday season and a lot of uh, people are buying goods therefore a lot of people are buying the stocks of the retailers. This is why FL will probably continue moving higher. So FL long over 74 and 74 cents. My second pick for the week is SBA Communications, SBAC short under 95 and 66 cents. Very nice downtrend. I expect it to continue moving lower. Uh, it's a wireless communication company with 25,000 tower, towers in the states and it looks like it's probably going to continue moving lower. I wish you a great trading week and see you next week.